but is this stuff working properly? Yeah, it's working better now. So welcome back to you guys. We've moved from the PS2, which was having technical troubles until we get a new controller. Uh, so now we're, we downloaded it on the Switch, or re-downloaded it on his Switch, uh, very kindly. So we are we're going back through the level again. Ah, crap. <laughs> Great start. A little bit. Uh, so he rebeat uh, Clown Man on this version, and we're in Grain Man. Is that what you said? Grenade Man. Grenade Man. Grenade Man. Uh, oh yeah, yeah. Oh. Great audio commentary, sir. Bro, you're the one not saying anything. Huh? I said you're the one not saying anything. You can talk also. Yeah, but when I'm not saying anything, you're supposed to fill stuff in. Well, yeah, okay, but you could all. I, I was leading you into saying uh, literally anything. Anyway, uh, <laughs> so here we are, back at Mega Man, and Rita's completely skipped over the the bolt part. Because um, I can't get it. That's why. Reed I I'm missing I'm missing a. An item for it or a weapon. It's not just a a, uh, a sequence of destroying those blocks. Nope. Oh. Ah, keep forgetting about that part. A little jumpy fish. Yeah. What weapon are you missing? Uh, if we fight the next boss, I get the weapon that he uses so that I can uh I can grab the <laughs> yeah. I grab the bolt. <laughs> But this is where you're for at. the meantime, <laughs> yeah, I gotta fight this fucker. I get all over. Oh no, I'm slide man. Yeah. <laughs> if you haven't seen our pilot episode of the, the Mega Man pilot episode, go. You can go watch that after this, or before this, or stop the video now, and you can go watch all of our videos, and then come back and finish this video. Uh, but yeah, so playing Mega Man. Because we found the we had the anniversary collection or legacy collection, I think you said. They, well, I think it's just okay. So on the network for the Switch, it's mm -hmm. called the legacy collection. Mm -hmm. So in this one, well, okay, so it it, bro it broke off in two parts. So the first one has games one through six. Okay. Oh wow, I barely survived that. Um, in this one, it has seven, eight. 9 and 10, I think, yeah. Oh, it has okay, those ones. Okay. So, unlike the one for the PS2, it doesn't have, like, power battles and stuff like that. Uh, which is alright. Yeah. And I forget what the mystery one is. It, the mystery one could actually just be the second power battle game. Well, if we get a new PS2 controller, we'll be able to... Oh, yeah, we'll just we'll just, we'll just wait on them to make one. I'm, I'm sure there's some production, Zach. <laughs> well, I know... Well, they had all those, like... Wireless ones you could do. We probably have a couple of those around here. Actually, Just yeah. have to, you know, find them. So yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, so you were talking about uh, like Proto Man and Mega Man and Bass and oh uh, base, okay so base and treble. Uh, I totally forgot. I totally forgot about this part. My brain wasn't working. Okay. Uh, if. Because I didn't know who Proto Man was. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Um. Sorry, brain's not working. I'm trying to concentrate. Uh, Mainly because of this part is, you know, that thing right over there. It's drop. It's uh. It lights that lights that match, and then freaking now the, now platforms are breaking. The stuff over there. Oh, like in the background. No, you see you see that thing. It's gonna drop a enemy oh. that lights that lights the fuse and it's destroying the platforms. Oh. Yeah, and you, oh, you gotta get out of there. Yep. And I missed the bolt, but mm. I'd rather live. <laughs> okay. You don't want uh, zero wealth and just to die with a bunch of material wealth? Mm, I'd just rather survive, because I'm gonna have to play this, play this stage again. I might, might as well, right? That's true. Anyways. Can um, you only get the bolt once? <clears throat> like, if you, if you have to... If you get the bolt the first time and you play it again, will it will the bolt be there, or will it not be there? Because you already got it. Uh, well, the bolt will be gone. It's a one-time thing. So, oh, that's well, not right. one time, but like you pick it up once and then that's yeah. it. Yeah. Okay. That's yeah. That's what I was saying. Okay. So. Grenade man. Nice yep. Backbone. Backbone. 
Oh shit, wrong, wrong, wrong button. I don't think that's what a flash button is. Ah, bitch. Bitch. Oh, okay. Flash bomb. Flash bomb. So, uh, what you do is, yeah, you're supposed to use uh, Clown Man's weapon. And you're supposed to just launch it back at him. Except, I'm doing terribly because the button is different. Uh, to use, uh... Between uh, the, the PS2 and that. Yep. And that's why I think I'm gonna die. I believe in you, you can do it. I don't yeah. believe in it myself, it's okay. Well, I don't I, believe enough for the new I'm getting, I'm getting my legs again for this game. Okay. Um, can but, you change the button configuration to... Uh, oh, yeah. yeah. Sure, let's see if I can. I think it's a thing. If I figure out... Nope, that's not it. That's not it. <laughs> pressing buttons, pressing buttons... Pressing buttons... Maybe you gotta uh, go to like the main option screen or something. No, there we go. Found oh. it. Okay, and button configuration. Oh. <laughs> Press the wrong button. There we go. Real <laughs> smart. Congratulations. Jump and shoot man. Jump and shoot man. Okay. Um, you got two jumps. See. I know, right? Like, why? Well, why is attack? Zach, shut your mouth. <laughs> okay, there's that, that. I th think that's how it was. Okay, yeah. That'll help. Okay, so if I press this button, yeah, there we go. Okay. Anyways, what I was gonna say about uh earlier, so in the Japanese, and I totally forgot about this part. Okay. Uh, bass is is called a uh, forte in English. Forte. Forte, and then treble is called gospel because everything's music, oh. right? Mm -hmm. And I totally forgot. Like, oh wait, that's right. They had different. They actually had different names in uh, uh, Japanese. Hmm. Yeah. Well, I mean, if Mega Man was Rockman, it can it would. <coughs> Which is why, like, other. I was confused because, like, it didn't make sense to me that uh, why they changed it to why they changed the name to Mega Man. But then I, I looked it up a, a while ago because I was like, okay, I gotta. Refresh myself on this information. Yeah, uh, they changed Mega Man to Mega Man, or they changed Rock Man to Mega Man simply because the uh, Cap the American Capcom director, or whatever, said like that's stupid. We're just changing to Mega Man now. Mm -hmm. So it wasn't just because like oh like we, we we can't approve this name for whatever reason. Like it's, no, it's just mm -hmm. it's a it's a stupid selfish reason mm -hmm. that he did it. But. I don't know, I'm just so used to being called Mega Man at this point that it just seems foreign to... To, to call it Rock Man. Yeah, unfortunately. Yeah. Almost like it's from another country. No, yeah, but, how about um, that? Yeah. <laughs> Weird. Um, I, I kind of get it, though. Like, The game itself doesn't have a lot to do with music, so for all the characters to be named after musical things doesn't seem to me to make a whole lot of sense. Like, I get the inspiration of doing that, mm -hmm. um, but the game itself doesn't have a lot to do with music. So... Make changing the name to something that would draw in more American audience, if that's what you're trying to, you know, if that's your audience, that's who you're trying to sell to. I get changing the name, because um, if you're, you know, playing Mega Man, it makes sense. But if you're playing like Rock Man and he either doesn't have a guitar or rock powers, then why would he be called Rock Man? I guess, but you know what? The like my counter to that is uh, fuck you. But no. Um, <laughs> Very no, covers. uh, the witty banter here is unimaginable. No, like, England. I can, I can, I can still see why they do it, why, why they name him Rock Man, only because, like, I mean, the music for all the Mega Man games is good. Gucci rocks, right? And no, the so I feel like, good. I feel like that, that alone kind of merits it being, being that. But mm. you know, whatever. I mean, it is what it is. Yeah. I mean, yeah, inspiration being what it is. I'm just saying, like, and the, mu no, the music is good. Ah, just, die, you the, scum. The game itself, like, you don't go around shooting rocks. You shoot, like, little laser bolts or laser bolts or whatever. So, I don't know. And, you know, it's fine, whatever. I'm not making any money off of it either way. Uh, unless somebody out there wants. Damn it. Unless you want to have a lively debate and pay me $1,000 or whatever for my very limited opinion on Mega Man. Ah, damn it. But... What? Oh, okay. I freaking hate this part. It's just... It's a freaking... 
it's slug because you got to start all over. Yeah. Yeah. And, and I think that. there's one more part after this I gotta do, which is the exact same thing. But aside from aside from that gripe, mm -hmm. this next part is probably my favorite. Oh, okay. This may be the most like interesting part of the entire game, I would say. I kind of like that bit where they're dropping all the, the enemies, because normally you deal with like two or three at a time, and this one is like, here's a shit ton! Yeah. Okay. This, this is part my, they're coming up. Yeah, this is my favorite part. Because you actually use Rush Jet. Ah, nice. This is like the one sequence I'm okay with. Uh, out of all Mega Man 8. Um, Mega no, Man 8 is no, trash, no. except for the part where you get to fly on, uh... No, 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 no. On Rush. It's just like it. It basically you, oh, like you, you play like you play like Gradius essentially. Mm. So like you can get like all Mega Man's friends. So in this case, I I got the bird uh -huh. uh, beat, and then uh, if another thing shows up, supposedly one's supposed to show up soon. There we go. Mm. You can pick between Auto or Brush. Mm. I got Rush, mm. and then you can get two of his other friends. Uh, did you not want auto? Huh? Or I like auto. Know? Auto's good because auto shoots like a, essentially a rocket launcher. Mm. Um, you get the other one. I I can't remember the the small little robot's name. It looks like it looks like those the metals. Oh okay. I can't uh, I can't remember. But he was. In, uh, I remember him being in, like the Mega Man cartoon because like or the American one uh, because like Mega Man be like injured or something and he'd appear out of nowhere and he. And then he'd show up, he'd be like, oh, Mega Man, you're weak. And then he'd give him, like, an item that, like, recovers uh, all his energy. Mega Man, you suck. Here's the thing that'll make yeah. you better. Where is he? Nope, I got auto. I, I can do auto. Auto! Is the other guy's name Toon? I got auto. And Toon. What's the name? I can't remember for the life of me. Well, it's probably probably news related. Uh, this is named Clef or Riff. No, or, uh, it it uh, wasn't it wasn't music related. There he is. Oh really? Yeah. He drops bombs, uh, and a, he's super good for like. Bomb drop yeah, he's super good for this part. And, and it looks like they're not taking any damage, so you can just throw them at any space. What's that need? I can't remember. Oh, if I had, I forget what item I need. I can blow that up, and I think it drops a bolt. Mm -hmm. But I totally whiffed on that part. Mm -hmm. uh, Does the option of who you can get? Oh, where'd have another boat? Huh? Oh, this is a new area. That's why. Uh, so you had to start all over again. Okay. Well, that was fine. Oh, okay, you asked because you already had the bird. If like they were out. Well, you also had Rush already, so. Yeah, it would make. make uh, Honestly, auto in this in this sequence is probably the best thing because he's just a frick As long as you hold down like the the fire button, yeah. he just keeps launching. Uh, but actually, all of them, as long as you keep holding on the fire button. Mm. What is that small robot's name? Oh, it's gonna drive me insane right now. That's okay. The small name. Of Eddie. Eddie. That's his name. Eddie. Yes. Ah. That's the name. Thank. Oh God, I finally remembered. It was named for Eddie Ico. Surfer from what? Zach. <laughs> or it's probably Eddie Van Halen, actually, now that I think about it. It could very well be. Um, that is his name, right? Oh, and uh, I remember from our I remember from our previous playthrough. Uh, yeah. Uh, I was thinking of that one character. So, so Mega Man Five, yeah, all the characters all the all the bosses' names were it were translated in English uh, mm -hmm. as uh, musicians, so Axel the Red was Axel, Axel Basil, Axel Rose. In this one, oh, I wonder if I can make it. Yeah, Eddie Van Halen. Okay. Uh, yeah, there we go. Got it. How do I get up? I wonder if the wind will pick me up. <laughs> <laughs> Tommy Reed. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. Um, no, but uh, the the Firefly Izzy Glow I mentioned. Uh, he's actually He's based off of Izzy. I forget the last name. You can. Zillia. No, 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 dummy. Um. Uh, uh. He was a guitarist for uh, Guns N' Roses. A former guitarist. Guns N' Roses guitarist. 
Yeah. You know, you go look it up now? Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, now that you mentioned it, Reed, I have yeah. to look it up. Yeah. Uh, but yeah. Um, and then they also had like they also had some other enemies which were kind of were kind of obvious. Like I think was, I think one of the bosses' name was like Slash Grizzly. Wait, so oh, it's based off of Slash, yeah. He was, what's up? Wait, wait. Who the the Izzy was named based off of who? One a former guitarist from uh, Guns N' Roses. Okay, because Slash is the guitarist from Guns N' Roses. Y yeah, I know, but they had a another another boss that was based off of Slash. And then now fighting the boss. Oh crap! Again, can't remember though. Ah, uh, crap baskets. Crap on a crapple. I realize I'm using the wrong weapon, which is okay. I can still fight the boss with this. Okay. The Guns N' Roses members. Mm hmm. Uh, Rose, the vocals. You could probably just type oh, in Dizzy. Uh, keyboardist. Well, that was another boss that was named like Dizzy. Okay. So. Oh. I killed the boss. Anyways. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Hold on, hold on. A former member, uh, yeah. Dizzy Stradlin. There you go. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I. Maybe all the Ram bosses Lee actually. are backing occasional lead vocals, percussion. Maybe all the bosses were named after people from Guns N' Roses, just to narrow it down. But a good chunk of them were, hmm. were from were from uh, Guns N' Roses, I believe. You gotta wonder how they feel about that, right? Or, I mean, I do. Well, like, see, that was that was an American thing. Like, America was just kind of like, oh yeah, well, fuck, we'll we'll just use them. Oh. So what were they named in the original Japanese? Uh. So, hold on, hold on. Okay. I think... So they changed Rockman to Mega Man. Mm -hmm. And they changed, you know, they changed a bunch of the other ones from music stuff to not music stuff because they're like, well, we're selling to American audience. But then when they named the bosses from their Japanese names, they named them into musical rock people. I don't know what to tell you. Yeah. I mean, you weren't in the board-making decision of this game from the early 90s, does really, it? Six-year-old or whatever. <laughs> Actually, when did Mega Man? Was that late nineties? Mm. Oh. Mega Man. I don't know the. I don't know the time. Wow, okay. so professional, Zach. <laughs> <laughs> Mega Man. Really? Oh, you're looking it up. Yeah. I think Mega Man was well. Mega Man itself, though, was like early, either early '90s or very, very, very late '80s, like '89 maybe. Yeah. Um, uh, Mega Man and the Rock Man in Japan is a Japanese science fiction game, video game franchise created by Capcom, starring a series of robot characters, each known by the moniker Mega Man. Mm -hmm. Mega Man released from for NES in 1987. Right. The first in a series that expanded over 50 games on multiple systems. Uh, as of March 31, 2021, that game has sold over 30 million units worldwide. Oh, I died. It's pretty impressive. Mm -hmm. Let's start again. Uh, let's look at, okay, so Mega Man 1987. Mega Man 2, 19, 1988. Uh, so 97 it started. 87. 87, yeah. sorry, 87. 1987 Mega Man 1, 1988 Mega Man 2. 90 was Mega Man 3 and DOS. Um, and Dr. Wily's Revenge. Maybe DOS? So I think it's talking about the Mega Man 8 was uh, 96. Okay. Yeah. Oh, that was kind of close. You were 7. Uh, and the most recent was Mega Man 11 in 2018. Okay. That's impressive. Oh, and then uh, 2018 Mega Man X Legacy Collection and Legacy Collection 2. Right. Yeah. Which is what we're playing. Yeah. So does the other Mega... The... We're Which playing one? the second? We're playing the second one because usually the first one had 1 through 6. Correct. Yeah. But this one doesn't have power fighters ever either. Nope. Uh, 
Now this is a secret thing that I'm, I'm unaware of. Maybe you have to unlock it. Could be. I mean, you had to unlock the second one from the first Legacy like, collection. It's nice when they like tell you what's coming up. Just, well, it's whether it's whether or not you, your your reflexes are fast enough to respond to it, though. That's, yeah, that's the problem. Because yeah, with the the screen being kind of as short as it is, and you're going as fast as you're going over that distance. Well, like I mean, this game expects your eyes to like tweak the f out. Uh -huh. Shit, I missed the bolt again. Damn it! Should I just kill myself? <laughs> I mean, I've done it once before, I could absolutely do it again. Oh, you're talking about in-game. Yeah. <laughs> no, I've got the bolted Mega Man, I should... No, Zach, I'm just gonna, like, drop the TV right on top of my face let myself die from that. <laughs> well, don't from do the that. impact. Then I wouldn't have to... I wouldn't be able to carry on the gameplay on my own in your honor. Ha, ah, wishful thinking. <laughs> <laughs> ah, I can start every episode with... That, uh, is it? Oh, uh, the McLaughlin song? In the arms of the angel! I just pick really terrible pictures of you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you would. In, in honor of Reed. Oh, and there was no let's see if I can do it now. I gotta wait till Asshole drops stuff. Okay. So, if I toss his weapon there, nice. I go right up. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. Ooh, right into the like a dingus. Good job, Reed. Okay, I, so, what's up? I was just gonna say, I don't know, like, thinking about it now, I don't know what I was doing, that I was doing anything else other than, like, this. Nope. Eh? No, go on. It Continue. Didn't do a thing? Yeah, I'm thinking of a different, different boss saw weapon. Uh, um, no, but, like, thinking about this kind of stuff, like, what was I doing if I wasn't playing video games? I don't know. Going outside, being a kid. <laughs> Ugh, a waste of a child. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, How am I supposed to be an a gamer if I have like friends as a child? Yeah, but I mean, you yourself are kind of a waste. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, I should probably actually just go over there first. <laughs> These guys are, like spinning into each other's mouths. Can I do it? Nope. Okay, so we'll do it this way. Plus the tornado. Oh no, gotta be further out. further out. Okay, so if I recall, remember, is he gonna be an asshole and just stay right above the <laughs> right above the steps? Ah, oh, you dick! You dick! Okay, if I recall, for the cracked ice, if you launch grenade man stuff, you can shatter nice. it. Oh, and the other one wasn't cracked, so you weren't able to use it. Yeah, you need a later weapon in order to uh, break, break, uh, break full ice. Yeah, break solid ice. Ah, oh, yeah, asshole. Okay, oh, there we go. Oh, and then was comes the next. Hmm. Was that health? Yeah, that was health. It's like a rave in here. Yeah. I mean, these ones get super annoying because they don't they don't hurt you; they just obscure your vision, right? Mm -hmm. And that was the thing I liked about Mega Man games is like, especially like the first couple, mm -hmm. and even to this one to a lesser extent, like they'll introduce an enemy at a part where like they don't do anything, but like you know what they do. So when they show up later in the game at a, like a part where like they can cause trouble, you're like, oh, okay, I know what they do. I mm -hmm. should get rid of them. Yeah, uh, like Aaron was talking in Sequelitis, the uh, enemy placement. The well, not just enemy placement, but the, the way you introduce the gameplay to the player is not... I mean, this is not a bad, good example, but the, like when they don't just tell you, oh, jump here, or do this, or whatever. They like... Oops. Like you said, they introduce these guys at, at a different part of the game so that you can kind of get used to them like a little bit at a time, and like you said, they, you figure out what they do. Mm -hmm. So that when the time comes, then they're like all up in your business, you'd be like, okay, I know how to deal with this. Um, and yeah, that's a really good. It's good for gameplay because it's good. It makes the players people want to play the game. Does it? Three. God damn it! What happened? Huh? I tried to slide at that part, but like my fingers weren't responding. Yeah, a little bit. 
you know, chunky nuggets. Zach, I assure you, <laughs> if you were if you were to have done this, I guarantee you, you would die faster than I would. I don't think that's true. Okay, you know what? I tell you what. How about when I die this next time? You don't have to. Yes, yeah, so you don't have to die. Too. How about when I die? No, no, no. When I die this next time, <laughs> I'll hand it to yes. you, and we'll see if you survive. We'll see how long you last. I'm sure it'll be fine. Damn it! I made it to the boss already. <laughs> Shit. I really want you to fight the boss, <laughs> just so I can, just so I can laugh. Laugh, I say. <laughs> laugh. Okay, so we're fighting Frostman. Are these other Mega Men? He made statues. Oh, okay. That's either cool or creepy. Oh my God! Freaking dubbing, so. Up. Up. Wow. Wow. That hurt. You hurt my face. Zach, did you voice over this game? No wonder it's so bad. <laughs> uh, excuse me, sir. I have a perfect dopey voice. It's the one I'm using right now. <laughs> oh, yeah. Your voice is so freaking amazing. I have the voice of an angel. Mm -hmm. An angel that has a terrible voice. Well, you got the first part right. Yeah. Yeah, I do have a voice of an angel. I appreciate that. Yeah, you're welcome. Frost I'll give that one to you. Okay. Little bit. Nice, you got three okay. more bolts. And then. Oh, cut um, Here we go. I'm almost finished. The battery will be charged in 10 minutes. 10 minutes. By the way, what do you make of He's so fucking dumpy. <laughs> okay, so all all those items right there are um, the stuff that all the bosses dropped, yeah. This is Yu Yu Hakusho in the animation. Oh, again, it's back from the 90s, right? right. That's, around that, that's around that period. Yeah. I've, I've definitely seen that background before. Mm-hmm. I think they just share backgrounds between well, anime and video games. Were those not all the power ups that you got? Hmm? Were those balls that they made? No, no. See, you. You just. Okay, so there's the part where after he kills the boss, right? He, he plays like the, the victory music and he runs over, he picks that thing up. And when he jumps in the air, all that energy went towards him, mm -hmm. and then he got the power. Yeah. And stuff. So, those little orb things is a completely separate entity. Oh, uh, okay. Because for story purposes, yeah, mm. that's supposed they to be... be separate. Well, no, for story purposes, that, that thing is like... You remember the beginning cutscene where he fights the, 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 the evil robot? Yes. That's what that is. I will see you again. Yeah, there you go. See? Oh... It explains it in cutscene. Yeah. What the? Mega Man, you must go after him. We don't know who he is. Oh, he's so dumpy. It's like a Cadbury cream egg. <laughs> <laughs> I think that was Alan Tudyk. Okay. You gotta go after it! There's a good chance I just might die simply because uh, I have no lives. Oh. And I I vaguely I vaguely recall this, this part being kinda hard. Okay, not dealing with that. Okay, let's see. If I were, I think you're supposed to use thunderclap. Yeah, there you go. Unless you swing across. I do like that, and and more than just like being able to play, I like that they almost double their gameplay by making the game the levels uh, playable multiple times. Uh, so they didn't. They didn't introduce that aspect of the game till like later. Well, I guess I'm saying for this one. 
like more specifically is that or or the other games I guess is that mm -hmm. like, for you basically value. double your your playtime if you're like oh you need this power up to to get this thing not shit but that power up isn't available in this level you're gonna have to go to a different level and get that power up and then go back to this level and use that power. yeah and that's pretty pretty a pretty good way to I think to maximize your game your playability for your game mm hmm ah oh, crap I hate this part you are we who are you <laughs> don't try to stop me Smee don't you dare try to stop me try to stop me Smee Smee get off your ass get over here nice dated hook reference hey hook is timeless okay <laughs> and you got it so you don't even get to talk why not <laughs> because you also love that movie. I do love that movie. Because yeah. it's a and it also and it's great. And if you haven't seen it, you should watch it. Because Rob Williams, Dustin Hoffman. Um, Go on, come on. Who else is in that movie? Uh, Julia Roberts. She was Tinkerbell. You also forgot Bob Hoskins. <laughs> a lot, you know, Smee. Bob Hoskins? Yeah, oh, he was Smee. I, yeah, you're right. I totally yeah. forgot. Also, um, oh, it's part of me. Dante Bosco was uh, who, oh Rufio, the, the voice of Zuko. Was oh Rufio. no, yeah, it, yeah, yeah, I was right. Okay, cool. Yeah. Oh, man. <laughs> I don't know, but you can let him escape. <clears throat> I wonder why. He might be I, dark dark I don't. I don't know if you ever got to play as Proto Man in any of the the actual that the. the the base Mega Man games. I don't think you did. Thanks, Proto Man. I know you could play. I know you can play as Proto Man in the Power Battles ah. series, but mm. so Proto Man, let me get this straight here. You jumped in just to let this guy escape, and we're just gonna have to catch up to the question later. Is that what happened? Oh uh, yeah, I guess. But good luck, I guess. I'm leaving now. Oh. <laughs> Oops! Oh, Rush was dead. <laughs> the <Anymore>. end. <laughs> Didn't have any more lives. Yep. That's it. Animal abuse. That's how you know he's the bad guy. I don't care about your love. Hmm. Yeah, 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 yeah. I didn't think you'd make it this far, Mega Man. However, I don't have time to deal with you. Oh, uh, you dumpy bastard. I don't have time to do anything. Just murder the child. <laughs> and through Mega Man's cries. Okay. Come on, dude, wrap it up! <laughs> <laughs> and you're not gonna question, like, how you got free? Yeah. I mean, you just gonna jump. I mean, I guess he would jump straight to your dog, yeah, because you're concerned, but still, it's just like, come on, dude. What? What was that? With the sole purpose to eliminate the evil energy from this universe. Oh, this game, oh, this music, the recorder. Hmm. I remember like the first time I saw this animation though, like, cause I was so used to like watching. Uh, oh, jeez. I was so used to playing like the first, like the first couple of Mega Man's, and then this one, or not this one, but uh, Mega Man X, mm -hmm. and then they didn't have this like animation yet. Mm -hmm. So when I saw this for the first time, I was like, oh my god, it looks so amazing. Yeah. Well, I mean, this is this animation was indicative of the time because mm -hmm. it looks, it's like. Well, no, like what I. Well, no, like, what I mean is, like, that the fact that they had, that they added, like, animation like this into, like, a Mega Man game when I'm just so used to, like, either 8-bit, more looking at, like, Mega Man X on the, on the Super NES. Yeah, I guess because like, they have better hardware, they could do stuff like this, yeah. Have, uh, like, cutscenes. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, yeah, hey, I get that. Yeah. Anyways, we should probably wrap this episode up, so... Well, why don't we 
Yeah. Wait for the cutscene? I mean, how long is this cutscene? God only knows at this point. It's really all it is, like, it's just to wrap this, just to wrap this dialogue up. It's just basically, like, the robot's name is Duo, he came from space, he's here to stop uh, Wily, and you and Mega Man team up. And then now the cutscene's over. So anyways, we'll wrap this episode up. Thank, Thank you for watching. watching. We'll see you, uh, we'll see you next time.